Hi Aquarius, so we're going to go ahead and get right into this reading. I am just pre-shuffling right now. Everything you need to know about me is down below. So I'm going to pull about six cards. All right, and just see what the message is for today. All right, and then I'll let you guys know. But before I do that, I am going to pull Oracle as well too. Also, everything you need to know about me is down below. All right. Ooh, a green card. Okay. Also, feel free to check out my second or third channel. All right. Um, these came out. I don't even putting them in there. That's weird. Okay. And then let's go ahead and pull some oracle. We're gonna start with the angel ancestor oracle here and see what's going on. Of course, I did get woken up out my sleep, so it has to be something. And it's like y'all, I be trying to do messages but it's like with my camera that i have y'all when i tell you it's so hard to transfer the fucking file the shit take like an hour to transfer one video y'all like it's stifling my progress stifling my readings as well okay um also if you put personal reading the link for that is down below let me see if i can just bring this up just a tad bit so y'all can see better all right so Okay. All right, so I have a couple cards here. The first card we have is the Medicine Guardian. Then next one we have is the Sage card here. We also have the Spirit of the Fox, Treasure Talents and Changing Times. And then the last one we have is the Sky Father. Okay, so this is kind of like the most high, okay, universe. And this card that flew all the way over here, let me go ahead and get it see what you guys need to know also i'm going to show you what these are these are like description cards i made somebody could definitely drive a black car that could be a significance or a black cars of significance the letter h somebody could have that in their name all right so the first card we have here um for some of you guys here you have some resurfacing information all right that's going to be coming from the past okay but as you guys here you may have someone here who wants to visit you or will be the messenger for this information we have 777 so this could definitely be um information about money look a dip um divine interventions karma um you know somebody snapping etc and then i put that green card there's really nothing here all right and then i have accidental death so i just feel like what's going on this reading is kind of about like you know um resurfacing information is going yeah a new monetary blessing this reading is going to kind of be like resurfacing information is coming to the collective okay so i'm guessing this is what this reading is going to be about that's why they woke me up yeah, for some of you guys here, this could be like very emotional for you guys here. All right, could be coming from a water sign as well too. All right, but for other you guys here, we have the moon cycle. You know, we did just have that. What was that? I can't even think of what the moon cycle was. Somebody could definitely comment that down below. But it says, take note of your intuitive messages. And here I am doing an intuitive message for you guys. All right, so let's go and take a look here. I feel like you guys need to be open at this current time, being to healing information or you know this resurfacing information as well too. It's coming either from the past, people from your past, or this could even be like people who have passed on, like if somebody has died an accidental death. Um, but this information is really regarding like money, finances, 777. You could be seeing debt like crazy. Um, yeah. But I feel like what's going on, let's pull your energy here, collective. All right, so we have the Ace of Wands reverse, which is no. Okay. So basically with this Ace of Wands reverse, what I'm getting here is that whatever this information is that's coming in with the five of cups energy at the bottom of the deck um you may feel as if you know you've already taken the loss um something is already lost it's no point or more importantly there's no point of looking behind you or trying to salvage or change or manipulate or shift anything all right um but i feel like what's going on is for the team is trying to call you to like more importantly be devoted and committed to the information more importantly um to things that are being resurfacing not resurfacing being um re can't even talk this morning things that are resurfacing okay yeah the seven of pentacles energy because i feel like what's going on um you actually gain more it will help you alleviate your work struggles or any type of hard work that you may have put in and you felt like you wasn't doing it right or you didn't get what you were thinking of or if something was a no before it's a yes now okay or you're going to get the information that why was it a no why did it not work yet with the nine of cups um but i feel like whatever the information is coming to you guys three of pentacles for those of you guys who is coming from somebody who wants to visit you or they want to come see you yeah with the hangman it's could definitely be like a pisces or a water placement here or this could be um 
you know, this information or this resurfacing information and facts is coming from somebody who you're going to be visiting or it's going to be popping up on you. For some of you guys here, I feel like with the Four of Cups, this could also be um, due to like a hard pill to swallow. Somebody can literally be swallowing pills. I know me, I always say something is a hard pill to swallow before I swallow my pills to so make them go down quicker. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's what I feel like was going on. Yeah, but I feel like with the Four of Cups, whatever the information and resurfacing information and facts is, um, this could, like, you know, be your justice. This could be, like, what you wanted to know or more importantly, what was withheld from you. All right, with the Four of Wands, somebody could even be withhold withholding or this could be, like, what somebody else heard. All right, but whatever the information is, it's supposed to be stabilizing to you. The Star card is supposed to bring back hope, faith, understanding, um, but more importantly, it's supposed to, like, brighten your aura, brighten your day. Also, with the King of Pentacles, for some of you guys here, um, when it comes to this accidental death, there could be somebody here who did pass on and it was accidental death or one thing led to another and they just passed away all right this person could be trying to send you information as well too with the ten of swords and the two of swords energy all right but i feel like either you're not paying them any mind or like you know more importantly you may keep thinking like is that you god is that you uncle grandma sister cousin whatever but this person views you as somebody who's like they're you're very powerful they're very proud of you but with the nine of wands you're shutting them out or you're not like paying attention to the signs, synchronicities, or the plans they're trying to implement, or what they're trying to show you. But it's going to be like, you know, um, what's directly in front of you here, okay? Um, but yeah, for those of you guys here, you will be receiving some new information as well, too. Okay? When it comes to um, monetary blessings, or blessings regarding money. Yeah, this is coming from your past, but I feel like the moon card, somebody could have sabotaged you. All right, or you didn't get the job with the Knight of Swords. I feel like wrap it up, wrap it up then. Like Joe Budden, when he was on the interview with the Migos, and they was like, wrap it up then, yeah. And Joe Budden was trying to be funny with them. I feel like what's going on for some of you guys here, um, you may have new monetary blessings on the way. Um, you know, good karma, luck, money, um, you know, all that stuff coming in, or divine interventions coming in. But this is like healing information to where you not only will be able to heal your finances or heal where you are now, okay. But I feel like you're going to realize, like, if somebody took a job from you or, like, you didn't get no money, you didn't get to be partner, you didn't get something that was supposed to be monetarily yours, um, I feel like the information is going to come in where you're going to realize, like, oh, this person sabotaged me with the moon card, or, oh, everybody was getting paid or getting this benefit or invited but me, or everybody got broken off but me, yeah, with the Ace of Wands energy, that's a yes, all right, but I feel like the Five of Pentacles, if you're out in the cold or you were struggling or having delays around your money or anything like that, you're going to realize with the Nine of Cups that it was never you to begin with, with the King of Cups energy it's never you okay you could have got emotionally upset about this in the past all right but you're going to realize that the knight of swords and five of clubs all the loss that you have taken here or whatever happened you're going to get the information and you will be able to salvage things nine of pentacles and have a good bounce back for some of you guys here with the magician card maybe even have a manifestation kind of it's i'm hearing beyond your wildest dreams okay i don't know why i'm hearing that all right also i hope you guys can hear me all right and then my TV show Welcome just started playing out of nowhere. Of Hold on, y'all. Tonight, it's just family. This week, we challenge... I'm watching RuPaul's Drag Race. Give me one second. Come on, now. Well, let's go ahead and take a look at the information that is going to be resurfacing. All right, for you guys. Somebody could be playing The Sims. I don't know. I'm gonna say Susu. Like somebody could definitely be <laughs> playing The Sims. That could be a significance. But let's see what's resurfacing information that's coming up towards you guys that they want you to pay attention. So for some of you guys here, you will have some information that's going to be resurfacing about some work drama. So there could have been some type of drama at your workplace here, okay, in the recent past. But I feel like somebody could definitely set up a hook for you or some type of. Um, trap a hook a trap a problem or something of the sort with the will of fortune what goes around comes around i feel like what's going on you're going to get some information where you're going to realize either air sign or water sign they're going to be getting their karma or you're going to realize that they were involved in some type of work drama it was supposed to backfire on you with the four of wands it's going to backfire on them yeah with the full card and the page of wands yep but the thing about this work drama is given like you know how they always say oh this is a happy work environment and this and that and this and that and all this stuff yeah i feel like what's going on you're gonna it's gonna be like some resurfacing information about who was really um working against you in the background and more important with the page of wands you know even though you have moved forward you may have changed jobs you may have traveled or you just 
don't give a fuck or you could be nonchalant or rate y'all to the bullshit i feel like the information is going to be coming back up all right because i feel like you need to know what happened or what's happening or what's going to happen next yeah for some of you guys somebody could work at a doctor's or a physician's office somebody could work in the medical field last card yeah and this says hasn't been themselves in so long okay yeah paparazzi and then i have visions during sex so i feel like what's going on you could have had like a vision here of like who was betraying you in some type of way um for some of you guys here and if us you guys here this could even be like work drama Ooh, i'm also picking up work drama somebody can be fucking with somebody at their job mm, having an affair anyways um for us you guys here paparazzi yeah, I feel like all the attention is going to be on somebody here who never thought that, you know, more importantly that everybody was going to see them in this way. But you're going to realize somebody is not going to be themselves or they're going to be off or there's going to be something off about them next time you see them at work. And it's going to be like, oh, okay, so it was you. It was you. Yeah, Ten of Swords. This person is done. They're finito. Somehow they've been stopped in their tracks. They've been removed. They've been fired. Something of that sort to a sports energy. And I feel like there was a lot of rumbling. Like, let's get ready to rumble. But, like, now it's time to rumble. And it's like, okay, with the Hermit card, it's being exposed. Or this person will be being exposed here. The information is coming to you specifically with the Four of Swords and Ten of Swords. So you can be put at rest. All right, so you can put at ease. And more importantly, you can get out of that fight or flight mode or that energy where Two of Cups, you think you can trust them. Or more importantly, looking at, you know, I'm hearing who's watching you or who's trying to befriend you okay or work alongside you now that this workplace drama has backfired let's go ahead and see what other information will be resurfacing here all right for the collective yeah for some of you guys here it says ships coming in so for some of you guys there's going to be some resurfacing information about the past about some ships coming in so you could definitely yeah festive times this could be like around christmas holidays kwanzaa um you know ash wednesday could be a significance let's go ahead and pull some tarot here actually i'm gonna sh i'm gonna switch my deck because i feel like what's going on here you're going to have healing information coming in but i feel like during these festive times here with the four pentacles something was kept from you or like there was supposed to be a ship coming in or something coming towards you three of pentacles but for some of you guys you could have opened your mouth too soon okay and fucked yourself up or this could also be energy where somebody may have known that you had ships coming in or something was specifically for you but with the four wands reversed i feel like what somebody did is snatched it right from underneath you like imagine you waiting at the dock, waiting at the dock, waiting at the dock. The whole time somebody else, then the ship then came and left. The shipment has already been delivered to somebody else. The ship then came and left, yeah. The temperance card burst, the death card burst. Let me turn these up right. Um, but yeah, I feel like what's going on, this will be balanced out. And more importantly, you're going to be getting your lick back here with the death card and the five of cups. So like I said, you could have lost some type of shipment, some type of deal. All right, this could even be like a collab here with the sun card. Or I feel like, you know, for some of you guys here, this could be an energy where like something happened during the festive times here. I'm, is my deck upside down? What the fuck is going on here? Yeah, Ten of Pentacles reverse or lost something that was very valuable to you. Like, lost a lot of money. All right, lost something that, you know, was supposed to set you up for years or was supposed to somehow um, push you along, move you forward, or make your life easier. All right, but I feel like that delay was not even your fault. And I feel like the pages towards you're going to realize that, oh, it was somebody hightailing me or trailing me the whole time. Y'all see how my deck is just total fuck up like this? It's like every time I do readings lately, y'all, it's always something going on. Like, Either the deck acting funny, the camera acting funny, I can't upload. Like, I was supposed to upload a video yesterday, all these days, but I cannot get any videos off this damn camera. That is so crazy to me. I'm guessing all this stuff is in the reverse. Like, what's going on here? Sorry, y'all, to be doing this on camera, but. Cha, 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 cha. Okay. Yeah, but like I said, y'all sheep's gonna be coming in, alright? This even be by the festive times as well, too. So, like, Christmas, the New Year's, Mother's Day, Father's Day, alright? But what's going on as well, too, um, healing information. Somebody gonna tell y'all, y'all look good, but y'all smell even better, alright? But I feel like what's going on, you're gonna have some information coming. But it's gonna be, like, from a person in the past, like... Yeah, King of Wands. This could be somebody here who has their eyes and vision set on you, but I feel like with the Tower card, um, your spiritual team could have disapproved of this person. 
or somebody to disapprove of this person or who they was or you could have disapproved of what they said or what they did but i feel like we have healing information coming back to you regarding the situation yeah this could even be like a neighbor okay who was trying to hit on you or a neighbor who had some type of interest in you but she was like nah i'm gonna cut their ass off i'm not really fucking with them this person could have been busted broke busted and disgusted here all right but you have some information from the past coming up about this person because i feel like with the full card of verse um this is gonna be the energy where it's like i'm glad i was not a fool like you're gonna see i'm glad i was not a fool for befriending or for going this neighbor or somebody who lives in like my complex or goes to my college or somebody who's like a neighbor to me or a roommate or something of that sort with the nine of cups like or like buying into their deal eight of pentacles working alongside them mm-mm-mm and I feel like two of swords, your spidey senses was going off the Knight of Cups. But now um you're gonna be able to witness um why you made the right decision to not fuck with this person. And you're gonna see them they can have like a family member, have a baby mom, baby dad, or somebody they're dealing with as well too, and you're gonna see them suffering or arguing or something like that, and you're gonna be like, Ooh, baby, I dodged a bullet. Okay, I dodged a motherfucking bullet, okay. Let's see what else you need to know at this current time being. Yeah, so we got some resurfacing information about the death in the family. All right. So for some of you guys here, there could be like a family friend or there could be a scandal going on where there's a family friend. Whoever this family friend is, they could drop a lemon here or like a little old, little dusty car, whatever it is. This person is real motherfucking messy, but guess what? They're about to spill the tea. They are about to spill the tea. Like this person could be really, really wise or they have like all the family secrets or they know a lot of information. Whoever this family friend is, baby, they're about to spill the motherfucking tea. Yeah, somebody could have passed away in the last couple years, okay? The last one to ten years, okay, in your family. And I feel like you could have realized like, hey, something is up about this or their health or this plan or what's going on. But you couldn't really put your finger on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel like what's going on. This person may genuinely care for you or the person who definitely passed away or the family. And this person about to be the light. Mm -hmm. Ace of Pentacles, Three of Cups, Sun Card, and the Four of Cups. I feel like they're gonna be saying some shit that people don't want to get out. People don't want to hear. People could also be saying this shit with the Page of Cups energy. Like this person is just with the Star Card, the Fool Card. Like they're foolish, or they could be trying to manipulate you against this person, saying like, oh. They don't know what they're talking about. This is just somebody here who, you know, they're just speaking about a lot of hollabaloo or they're at halt, they're drunk, or they don't know what they're talking about. But I feel like with three cups and the four cups, they could have been excluded by the family here or like there was some type of um, isolation this person's going through here. Or it's even like shunning, like the silence of the lambs move could be a significance, but I feel like the sun card, this person not holding their tongue any longer. All right person not holding their tongue any fucking longer with the high priestess reverse i feel like they're letting that shit rip they letting that shit go all right and i feel like with the page of swords you got the family or family members here um watching this go down seeing if you're going to accept the offer accept the information or they're going to try to figure out like who believes them and who doesn't okay it's gonna be a big ass mess all right this could also be at somebody's like birthday party or something like that but yeah i feel like they may even try to denote this person for being like messy but with the justice card baby they're delivering justice all right, with the two of wands, and they have finally made a decision here. Queen of Pentacles, this person could also be well off, have money, or take really good care of their family, be a caregiver, kids, whatever. They have a very nurturing, loving energy, but with the Page of Pentacles, this person could have realized, like, look, I'm holding on to this um, when I can really just Queen of Wands. Um, instead of holding on to the power, holding on to the position, holding on to the truth, um, I can really just let that shit rip. You know, five of pentacles. I don't give a fuck about my on the cold. I don't give a fuck about how much money I get or if my re reputation is fucked up or, you know, whatever happens to the family. This needs to be out or this needs to be talked about. Two of pentacles energy. This person is tired of going back and forth, juggling, being two faced or doing something for the fam. The five of wands is still feeling conflicted or they're still building like build up, drama, chaos, dreams are still being sold with the tower card. And, you know, things are just, you know, there's one tower after the, after another with the nine of pentacles. And this person's holding the key with the cherry cards. So I feel like what's going on, they may say what they're going to say with the high, um, not the high priest, excuse me, the hangman, the four of swords. And after that, they may just disappear. Yeah, eight, eight of swords, ace of wands here. Or people may even try to say they messy, they crazy and all that stuff. But I think that the six of wands, they're going to do what they're meant to do or do what they're supposed to do on their path. The two of cups energy. Even though whoever this family friend is, they may also care a lot about you. Because whoever they passed away, I feel like they talked about you a lot as well too in a very good way. 
um despite what you may think okay so yeah judgment is here judgment is here and there ain't nothing that could be done let's see what other resurfacing information is going to be coming up for the collective i wish i could make this longer okay so it says judgment is upon you all right so we're going to have some resurfacing information it's giving you like roll the clips natural beauty okay like you know how they have those old clips where they play like sports highlights that could be a significance like pull the lever cronk like you know who's goes new goose could be a significance all right, but I feel like what's going on, it's going to be some resurfacing information about you guys. So, for some of you guys here, um, I feel like you're about to blow. You're about to get some type of um, attention or, you know, more importantly, something that's about to be all about you. But I feel like in the past, what was going on here is that, hmm, there was somebody here who could have, yeah, paid the source. They're stalking you. Three of Wands, watching your every move or your next moves here. The King of Wands, they don't have to be a fire sign at all. This person could just definitely have fire or air, highly aspected in a chart. But I feel like what's going on here, Collective, is that um, there is going to be some resurfacing information about judgment, literally at the bottom of the deck, being called upon you. Seven of Pentacles, are you getting what you want? I feel like you need to be more devoted to loving yourself more. This could be exactly what you are doing or what you could have been doing, showing your natural beauty more. All right. Um, loving you and not just your, not really accommodation. What do they call them? Um, body modifications. But I feel like there's going to be a truth that's going to be revealed here. Because you're going to realize this whole time it's been this person. The strength card. Yeah, it's been this person who was cruel to animals here or cruel to different people. Four Pentacles who's been holding you back this whole time. Or have been doing things behind the scenes here. So you wouldn't be able to benefit or you wouldn't be able to harvest or have different things come up for you. You wouldn't be able to blow up. Two of Swords here. Okay, Six of Cups. Maybe somebody you know from your past or for quite some time. But I feel like this is definitely a female. Or somebody who's in their feminine energy here with the tower card. I feel like you're going to realize that it was this person all along who was hindering you. Whether it was like on the outside looking in, inside looking out, whatever it is. It's giving like a gang stalking energy. Um, monitoring spirit energy. Okay. But I feel like whoever this person is, yeah. They may know that you're a true ass person. I feel like judgment could be upon you because despite you being a true person, yeah, there could have been a divine intervention that had to happen in the past here to protect your noble spirit or who you was and to get you away from this person just enough to where you can blow up or you're about to. Um, but whoever this person is, this person could be like a minor or a younger person, like they either are younger than you or this could just be how they act. All right, but for some of you guys here, if you're not about to blow up, you're about to get a new car or a new home, you're about to move, you're about to have something good happen for you and I feel like you have a noble spirit person has a corrupted spirit all right um but last but not least here i feel like you could have been coming together and enjoying um things with this person together but this was all a facade yeah but this all could have been like trauma dumping or like a trauma bond you have with this person but that was not needs not that was not needs last but not least here um this could definitely be like a female friend all right who got a thing for you but i feel like this person is very nosy um but yeah in a couple hours you may be hearing from this person all right, but or more importantly, they could be getting a reading on you, or you may need to get a reading on them. But I feel like, yeah, this person wanted you to be in no man's land, so they continue to stack, stock, and flip it, or flip your shit. All right, but everything's gonna be come back to you, including the information, including what you need to know.